For about 17 years, the African Independent Pentecostal Church of Africa, AIPCA, has been in the limelight following endless leadership wrangles. Today, the same was witnessed at the AIPCA Bahati Church in Nairobi. Police arriving in their numbers to restore order as two factions of the same church were at loggerheads following financial quarrels. We are not here to punish our archbishop. We support Archbishop Wangombe 100%. And nobody should shift, nobody should shift his battles to the altar. It has happened in the past and it will, we will not allow it to happen again. The two factions held services concurrently, one inside the church led by Archbishop Frederick Wangombe and the other one congregated outside the church led by Chairman of the Elders Nungu Kamande demanding an audit of church funds for the last eight years. If our agenda is not met, every Sunday we shall be meeting here, we have our service, then we go home. Kumekuwa na harambe mingi sana kwa ikanisa, na iyo harambe tukifanya, ile sababu imekuwa ikifanya tufanya iyo harambe, haithimiki, inakuwa pesa imetolewa, lakini ile kitu ilikuwa inafanya tufanya iyo harambe, we don't experience it. Sasa tukasema, we must ask for accountability, diyo pesa yetu tujue kwenye mendo. They want the church to account how 36.6 million shillings was used. Kuna fellowship members, when your members were able to stole responsibility, wao, wafuate mambo ya pesa. Sasa instead ya hao kuenda kuchukua jibu, walipoenda kuchukua jibu, walifukuzu wakatimuliwa kwa viti vya. According to them, the funds spent are questionable. For instance, in 2018-2019, the church used 8,200,288 shillings to reconstruct the gate and toilets. In 2020, the church claims to have used 6,400,315 shillings in a period of three months to pay school salaries. A school plot amounting to 9 million shillings was spent, yet the congregants say they didn't preview documentation, payment details, lawyer fees, valuation among other receipts. Tulikuwa tumetua pesa ya kununua viti. Ukigia huko kanisani ndani utaona huko juu hakuna viti. Kuna murade ya kununua solar panel. We had uh, made a plan of uh, saving our money on, uh, uh, on energy. Sora hii kununuliwa. Kuna gate hile unaona pale. Kuna pesa mimi mwenyewe kama kiongozi wa waze. After the coming of the police and a few leaders, board members convened to listen to their pleas. The board is expected to draft a report and recommendations afterwards. Power struggles at the APC church has refused to go away despite past intervention by former retired President Uhuru Kenyatta in April 2022. Recently, Deputy President Rugathi Gashagwa vowed to act as a peace ambassador and help end the perennial rifts that have rocked the church. Harriet Chimea, K24.